when you guys start letting people know about the golf and the NFM event soon. Yeah, make sure that if you guys are pulling up to the NFM events, you guys go to the website. For those that don't know, we woo, we woo. We are having our big M fam get together this year in Las Vegas, and it's in a month. There's still plenty of time. You guys can sign up. However, for the specific things that we're doing that only have a certain amount of people, they're filling up fast. Okay, and a couple things I'm gonna say about this. Make sure you fill out the form for not only yourself and your email, but let's say you wanna bring your girlfriend, you wanna bring your wife, or you wanna bring your mom or your dad or a friend. You gotta fill out a form for them too, okay? Otherwise, it's gonna be a big debacle when you pull up. You're gonna pull up and you're gonna have somebody, have two friends, and we just can't, we're literally gonna turn you away. You won't be turned away from everything. You won't be able to do the couple things that you have to sign up for. Now, if it's like an MFAM HQ, you guys are all welcome. Pull up, have fun, food, drinks, all on us. I'll pull it up real quick, we'll go over it. It's a big event, guys. We're spending a lot of money. We're gonna cap off the year in a big way, okay? It's at the Palms Casino in Las Vegas. We're taking it over. I mean, we have everything, man. We have tables, we have a- Is it a crime that I literally signed up for everything, lol? No, Blue, no, not at all. I mean, listen, it's not a million things, but the couple big things that we're doing, Chad, I'm gonna go over them, okay? So, the Palms Casino is our HQ, okay? We have discounted rooms there for you guys. It's gonna be really expensive to go to Vegas during that time. There's a lot going on in Vegas. We have sea fights, football games, there's TwitchCon, there's all kinds of shit. We have a phase arcade that's going on, okay? That you guys can sign up for food drinks the phase arcade is going to kind of be like if you guys pulled up to san diego and you, you came to our pizza joint that's what this is going to be so make sure everyone signs up for this we'll have plenty of room for everybody the classic is what we're calling it it's going to be our first golf event it's going to be very uh, private it's at a private golf course a very popular one that i can't talk about yet because we don't want a bunch of people showing up and going crazy but we'll give those details in time we locked in a wild course we got a lot of room for people. We don't have room for everybody. So make sure you sign up now. Make sure you pack your golf clubs, all that, okay? You don't have to be great to play in this thing, man. We're probably gonna be doing scramble. It's gonna be fun, man, right? We're doing a like our first official watch party where we'll buy the fight. We have a theater. I can't disclose the theater yet. It's very close by. We have a theater. I think it seats around like, I don't know, 200 to 300 people. It's a big theater. And we're gonna have the fights on with food, and drinks popcorn for everybody and we're gonna watch mma i'm placing bets beforehand guys listen it's gonna be a fucking fun ass weekend we're gonna have football on at the hq the face arcade is gonna be showing all the nfl games all the college football games we got a ufc watch party during the day as well we're going hard it's gonna be a lot of fun this is our one big event that we're doing this year we're not doing another one so if you guys are interested lit cool i'll see you there if not all good probably will be more however i have a kid i'm gonna have another one and another one, and another one, and another one. And by the time I have about five kids, okay, I'm gonna be 40 years old, okay? And when I'm 40 and I got five kids, little Nico is gonna be playing about two or three or four, maybe even five sports. I'm gonna be all over the place with him. And then I'm gonna be all over the place with my next son, and my next son, and my next son, and then when I have my daughter. She's gonna be in ballet, and she'll be ice skating. The point is, I'm gonna be around with all my babies, all right? So I don't know how much time we're gonna have for these kinds of events. You know, it's kind of feeling like I would love to make time to do one big one every year. I think we can still do that, but like we got to get them in when we get them in right now. We got to can't waste our time, you know? Let's have fun. Let's enjoy the time that we're here, man. We're all here. Hold up if you can. If not, there should be another one. I hope there's another one. Retirement speech? No, back would just be a real speech, man. Shit. These events are hard to do, bro. It's three days, four days out in Vegas, man. It's a lot. Imagine having five kids. Why am I going to do that? I already told you all, man. I, listen, I accomplished so much in this space. I still want to pop it off. I still want to do my thing. I love doing what I'm doing, man. But I'm very excited to be a father. And, and in being a father, you know, it takes a lot of time. It takes a lot of energy. It takes a lot of things that you got to do, man. I'm going to be a damn good father, bro. You know what I'm saying? It, it's going to be tough. I'm just saying, bro. So these kinds of events, let's enjoy them as they're here, bro. It's a big event that we're doing. It's in Las Vegas at the Palms, doing all kinds of crazy shit. Let's pop this one off, man. You only live once, man. I'm treating this event like I ain't gonna get another one. When I'm probably going to, but I'm gonna treat every event like that. Like this is my last one type, type of beat. You know what I mean? Controller, you know, like when I think about streaming, I don't think I'll ever get to a point, honestly, where like I don't wanna get on and make content and do things. You, you know what I'm saying? I can't even imagine a life of mine where I'm not hanging with you guys for a certain amount of time. Does that make sense? But if we're gonna play this thing where like I'm doing 12 hour streams of gaming 
forever. Like, no way. I can't. I can't. I'm, I'm a, I, you gotta be a, you gotta be a father. It's hard, you know? You can do it right now. Shit, you know? Yeah, bro, that's mad depressing to think about. There'll eventually be a time where you don't really have time like you used to to play video games on stream like that. Ah, oh, B-Bark, I wouldn't say that's necessarily true. Being the man that brings the bread into the house that I am, you know, I, I have to work, right? 40 hours a week. That's an expectation as far as I'm concerned, right? Now, there will be a day where I, I take it back and I, I, I wouldn't say I retire, but maybe I just take back the hours a little bit. I think the point that I was getting at is, you know, historically and throughout my career, I, I've been a, a very big grinder. I mean, I put in a lot of time, bro. And I don't know if when I have all these children, I'll be able to have the time that I usually put in. Do you, you know what I mean? That doesn't just equate or mean that I'm not gonna stream anymore or I'm not gonna stream at all. That's not what I'm saying, you know? I'm just saying like, how am I gonna do a 12 hour stream if I gotta take the kid to football practice? Right? I gotta help him with his homework. And I'm gonna have to do that. I gotta coach him up. I gotta take him around. I gotta take him places. And we gotta go do things. So, you know, I'm just preparing in my mind. You know, I mean, everybody gets to a point in their career where they gotta, you know, kick it back a little bit, right? I'll help him with the homework part. You, know, you just, what you'll we'll do, you, you're you gonna coach him. You coach him. Or when you, when you start to suck a little bit, then you're like fucking 30, we'll put him on your team. Then you, him, and another, 18 year old crackhead that you guys play and take over apex five you him and gents kid exactly bro oh my god tripod juniors that's hard bro oh my god that's hard that's lit triple roller gang pissing everybody off man getting it done no questions no factors yeah don't be sad about it guys this is great things man this is, these are all great things. We're in it for a grip, don't trip. We're in it for a grip, don't trip. Nothing's changing, nothing. But down the line, you have to think about these things, you know what I mean? And I spend so much time with my little man because I work from home, so I'm, I'm always here, we're always we're always hanging. I, you know, I, I look at him all the time, like, I can't wait when he's playing sports and shit, school, I just, oh, I can't wait. And I know I can't, it's gonna be hard anyway to do a 12 hour League of Legends stream. Being a streamer definitely helps with being able to work and still spend time with the family, oh, big time. Yeah, when you, know, you work from home, the little kids right there. I see him a hundred times a day. You know, imagine being a father, and I'm sure a lot of you guys are. You're a father, you gotta go to work. And bro, you're gone 10 hours a day. You know, eight plus the commute, five days a week, right? Gone, not home. You can do FaceTime maybe, check in FaceTime, check in with pictures and whatnot, but you don't see him until you get home. Me, every time I go to the bathroom, I say what's up to the kid, you know? You think you're hyped to watch football now, just wait through your little man is playing. I, I, I can't even. I'm more excited to see him on the mat than I am on the field. He's gonna be a hammer, bro. You should see this kid right now, Chad. You should see this kid. We laid him out today, naked. No, no, no diaper or nothing on his belly, you know? His back is just... That big turtle shell. Fucking... Oh, my God. Little animal right now, bro. Animal.